Shalom Aleichem. In this week's Parsha, Parshat Vayechi, Yosef brings his two boys, Minashe and Ephraim, to Yaakov for blessing. He realizes that soon Yaakov is going to leave. And he wants to use the opportunities to receive the precious blessing for his two sons. Yaakov looks at the two boys and tell, gives them a blessing. May the Jewish people for all future history bless their children with you and say to their children, Yesimcha Elohim ke Ephraim vechimenashe. May God make you like Ephraim and like Menashe. And the question is asked, what kind of blessing is it for Ephraim and Menashe? Just to say, the Jewish people should bless their children that they should be like Ephraim and Menashe. What about giving the actual blessing to Ephraim? Ephraim, you should be successful. Minashe, you should learn Torah and be wealthy. No personal blessing for them. Jewish people will bless their children with Ephraim and Minashe's example. And of course, the answer we all understand is that <clears throat> he's giving them the greatest blessing. He's telling Ephraim and Minashe, you should be so successful that all future generations will aspire that their children should be like you. And that is the blessing we should actually give to our children. Often parents think, what should I bless my child with? That you should finish college, that you should get married, that you should have children, that you should become rich. No, forget about all the blessings and just say, may you become like Ephraim and Menashe. All the blessings of the Torah, all the blessings of life are contained in those few words. May you become like Ephraim and Menashe. And if you want to add, you can say, and may others bless their children to be like you. Bezat Hashem, may we live a life that our descendants and all those that see us should aspire to be like we are. They should pray to Hashem, please make me like that great man that I know. Shabbat shalom umevorach. Chazak, chazak, v'nit chazek.